Hello guys, this is Mauro from PeerInfotech.com and in this video I just want to show you a quick feature on Windows 10 uh, that involves uh, scrolling and that is that now on Windows 10 you'll be able to scroll active windows and inactive windows. Um, here I have two uh, windows open and I'm using a virtual machine for Windows 10 but these two windows right here are from uh, Windows 8.1 and as you can see right now on Windows 8.1, you have you can scroll um, the uh, the content from one window, but you can't do it in the other one when you shift or when you move the mouse to another uh, windows because it's inactive. Um, so you have to actually click inside of that um, window, and then you'll be able to scroll. If you want to go back, you can do that. So on Windows 10, I want to show you that um, that's no longer true, and, and now it's much better. So now if you go to uh, Devices, and then you go to Mouse and Touchpad, you'll see that uh, scroll inactive windows. When you hover over those windows, it will uh, you will be able to use this feature. So by default, it's on. If it's not, you just come to these settings and switch it on and then you can just uh, get two uh, two windows and now you can see that I can scroll one and I'm still focused on this window but then I move over the um, the mouse I'm not clicking on it as you can see it's not active as you see right here the uh, the darker color of the uh, of the title bar and I am able to scroll the uh, uh, the content without me having to actually click on the um, to bring the attention to the uh, uh, to the to this window and that's really helpful when you're uh, working with um with an article or or like you you know just writing something and you just need to have snap windows and you just need to uh, scroll to see to see more of the content and you just don't wanna uh, click and focus on another uh, window. So that's yeah. Now, now if you go back, you can switch it off so you can see that now, you, like moving the the mouse over, it doesn't allow you to scroll the inactive window. But you know, you just switch it on, and now you can. All right. So I hope this video was informative for you, and I'll do thank you for viewing.